Welcome, I'm Jeff Kazee, and I'm with Jermaine Kia, and I'd like to introduce you to the new Motor Trend SUV of the Year, the Kia Telluride. So here we are at the front of the Telluride. I'd like to point out the daytime running LED lights, the functional vent for airflow to better gas mileage and also to help cool down the brakes. The front end design is cued from a lot of luxury designs and you'll notice that. And one thing that I really enjoy is that they've hidden some of the safety features down here which we will get into a little bit later. So here we have a machine 20 inch alloy wheel wrapped in a Michelin all season tire. Plenty of ground space, it's up to eight inches. Also we have the mirror here with the bright turn signal, the integrated blind spot detection. Keyless entry for locking and unlocking the vehicle. We have a seamless design in the windows here to make it look fluent. Then also the greatest thing about the Telluride, 24 miles a gallon on the highway, 19 in the city for a combined 21 miles a gallon. Here we have the LED elongated tail lights, the all wheel drive option. We have some parking sensors down here. Also there is available tow package with a self leveling rear with a 5,000 pound capacity. And here we have a windshield wiper with a mister also. And then here we have the backup camera with rear cross traffic alert. Now let me introduce you to the interior of the vehicle. One thing that you will notice about the Telluride is this smart, adjustable power lift gate. So if your garage is a little low, you can adjust that very easily. Also, there is cup holders on both sides in the third row. There is a 12 volt, a volt converter here. USB on both sides also. Air vents to keep everybody a little bit cooler or warmer. Also, you have tethering back here for a child seat, which is very important. The seats are very easily put up. Just pull, headrest is up. What is really nice about these third row seats is they actually recline, which gives you a little bit more headroom. Very easy to put down, as I said. Then if you are loading something into the car, it's very easy to lower the second row with the push of a button. So one thing I'd like to point out is also the available roof rack, just in case there is not enough cargo space that allows you to put things on top of the vehicle. One thing that's really special to us is the elongated door, which keeps your pants a little bit cleaner in the snow and dirt, which opens the inside. So now that I've showed you the outside of the Telluride, I'd like to invite you to the inside. Here in the second row of the Telluride, we have the built-in child screens, which are great. Believe me, those are amazing. Let's look at the available captain chairs that we have here. This also has a bench seat option for those who need an eight passenger as well. As I step into the Telluride, one thing I really like is the lower floorboard for greater leg room, the concaved back of the chair to give your knees just a little bit more room. Also, you have the USB ports on both of these chairs, which are really, really functional. As I turn, this is the third row, and this third row is actually being able to be used by an adult. I am almost six foot tall, so I will sit back here, and you will notice that I have plenty of headroom. Also, it's very comfortable in this position. One 
thing you'll notice in the Kia Telluride is there is no cloth seats. There is a wide variety of colors to choose from for the interior options, such as gray, dark brown, light brown, and even a burgundy color. One thing that's really, really nice to me is the wood finish here with the metallic two-tone application, available navigation. You also have wireless charging capabilities. You have multiple USB ports, heated seats, cooled seats, cup holders, and a really deep center console with another USB port. Here in the driver's seat, one thing you'll notice is all of your Apple and Android CarPlay options are going to be on the left-hand side. There is numerous driving functions on the Telluride. You have Smart, Sport, Comfort, Echo, and Snow. So for whatever function or driving you occur during the day, we can take it on. Then also you have a digital readout of your speed to help keep your eyes focused on the road driving forward. Now that I've given you a slight demonstration on the inside and outside, I'd like to take you out on a test drive and show you the safety and performance features. One thing I've noticed about driving this for the first time is how smooth, yet, peppy it is. Um, there, everything seems to be very easily reached. Um, I have the ability to adjust the dual climate control without even barely moving my hands. Um, looks like I have the smart adaptive cruise control feature which is amazing. Digital readout on the speedometer. All the safety features are right here at the touch on the left hand side which is really nice. One thing that's really, really nice is this is actually a semi-autonomous vehicle. This has the highway driving assist, which means once your lane keep assist is active, your smart adaptive cruise control is active, and you meet all the other requirements such as speed, you can literally just take your hands off the wheel and the car will drive itself. We'll stop, um, it'll actually let you know if something is going to be coming in your in your way um, which is actually a great feature and helps keep you um, a little bit more aware with driving on long distances um, the blind spot is very easily visible um, it's nice and it's kind of a little bit not too loud but it also grabs your attention if there is something in the um, in the blind spot which is actually really really nice So now that we've driven the Kia Telluride, I'd like to tell you a little bit about the performance. It has a 3.8 V6, 291 horsepower, eight speed transmission, available in front wheel and all wheel drive. If you'd like to learn a little bit more about the Kia Telluride, please visit our website at germainkiaofcolumbus.com.